everyone, my name is Casey Blankenship and today I'm going to be discussing an individual case analysis over Krispy Kreme Donuts. First, I'm going to summarize the major problem. Krispy Kreme Donuts is a globally known brand looking for a new strategic plan that will help them to stand out from their competitors. They are best known for their hot fresh donuts that are made daily in their factory stores. Making hot fresh and unique donuts is what they do best. However, the company has had issues keeping up with their competition. In the coming years, Krispy Kreme Donuts will more than likely face many problems. These problems arise from successful competitors, potential takeovers, and the healthy eating public. The franchise expanded too quickly and thus had to close many stores. The losses from overexpansion outweighed the benefits. They seem to have lost their strategy and what their vision was. The opportunities that they have now is to introduce limited time offers, appeal to the health conscious market, and pinpoint advantages that they have to their competitors. What we will cover today in the presentation is the organization information and objectives, organizational vision and mission, and their current strategy, the SWOT analysis, the competitive analysis, my recommendation for the course of action and justification, and the implementation plan. Organizational information and objective. Krispy Kreme began selling their donuts to a local grocery store until the scent of donuts attracted the local customers walking by. They wanted to buy fresh and hot donuts. The founder, Vernon Ru Rudolph, listened to the customer's demand and started selling hot original glazed donuts directly to the customers on the street. The hot fresh donuts became so popular that the company decided to put out a display case for the customers to browse and admire all the delicious donuts they offer. They also became known for their donut theater style of factory stores where they would display the process of the donuts being made right there in the store. They felt like the donut theater revealed the firm's commitment to quality and freshness. Um, Krispy Kreme Donuts objective was to be an enjoyable and entertaining place to get a freshly made and unique donut. Their vision and their mission statement and their current strategy. The mission statement, it's listed on their website and it reads, customers are our lifeblood, the center of the donut. There is no substitute for quality in our service to consumers. Impeccable presentation is critical wherever Krispy Kreme is sold. We must produce a collaborative team effort that is unexcelled. We must cast the best possible image in all that we do. We must never settle for second best. We deliver on our commitments. We must coach our team to ever better results. Their vision, is to be the worldwide leader in sharing delicious tastes and creating joyful memories. And their current strategy is hot fresh donuts. They want to be known for their unique taste and brand. Now we'll review the SWOT analysis. First off is the strengths. Their strengths are that they are affordable, high quality donuts with a one of a kind taste. They have a neon hot donut sign that encourages passer buyers to make an impulse purchase. They're consistent expanding. They make community relationships through fundraising. The products are sold at thousands of supermarkets, convenience stores, and retail outlets. Their weaknesses are that they had several closing stores when stores should be opening at a steady rate to keep up with competitors' growth. They have a slow product product line to expand beyond sweet treats to appeal to the health conscious customers. Their advertising is not aggressive enough to appeal to all of their locations. Revenues decreasing and continuous net losses in the past. The opportunities that they have to thrive would be Dunkin Donuts does not have a hot donuts um, sign like Krispy Kreme does. Starbucks lacks a distinctive pastry line. Many children love sweets, so they can appeal to that. Most people view a donut as a treat. Detection of the problem in management that is causing the business to fall. Hiring a chief strategy officer. And offering limited time products. The threats that they could encounter is tough competition and increased brand recognition of both Starbucks and Dunkin' Donuts. Starbucks has many more locations worldwide than Krispy Kreme Donuts. People are becoming more health conscious and decreasing their high sugar and high fat intake. Dunkin' Donuts is the leader in the donut market. They account for 54%. Shareholders may sell 
Krispy Kreme stock for a lack of returns and dividends compared to other similar firms in the industries. The competitive analysis, um, what their competition is, is every business has competition. Understanding the strengths and weaknesses of the competition is vital for the business to survive and grow. Krispy Kreme's top three competitors are Dunkin' Donuts, Starbucks, and Tim Hortons. Of course, Starbucks and Dunkin' Donuts are the biggest threats to Krispy Kreme because of their growing success. Dunkin' Brand is the top in the donut market, while Starbucks is the top in the coffee market. The biggest difference between Krispy Kreme and Dunkin' Donuts is the preparation. Dunkin' Donuts are shipped in by truck daily, while Krispy Kreme makes their donuts fresh in the store. Dunkin' Brands are great with their advertising and successful appeal to all breakfast lovers by offering other breakfast options as well as specialty coffees. On the other hand, Krispy Kreme sticks to what they do best, which is donuts. My recommended course of action and the justification for that. Over expanding too quickly caused many of their locations to close, so it is vi viable for Krispy Kreme to focus on opening more stores to catch up with their competitors. Since their locations are spread out through throughout the United States and there are few compared to the competition, then it would be beneficial for them to open more locations closer together and reaching out to more of the fans locally. Implementation plan. The first step in the plan is for Krispy Kreme to focus their efforts on opening more locations and gaining back their trusted customers in the areas that they had to close the stores in the past. Next, they could hire a chief strategy officer to oversee the plan and report the success of the firm. The CSO could also continue to implement ideas that will keep Krispy Kreme number one above their competitors. It is easier said than done, but having a person or team committed to this job will ensure that the plan will be successful. Develop a marketing strategy that will incorporate more advertising opportunities. They could start out with something small like an ad on social media or flyers, then focus on bigger opportunities as the firm opens more stores and promotes limited time offers. In conclusion, Krispy Kreme Donuts is a well-known and successful company that has, lost, ha, has not lost its way quite yet. They did get off track for a little bit, but it's not too late to turn things around with the right plan and the right people in place to implement growth. Thank you.